y'all I have not picked up this camera all week but we are about to head in Marshalls I figure I'd take y'all along with me and see what they have it looks like it's a lot of people in here because I had a hard time finding parts so let's see what we got going on did I ever ask you to take me to go shopping in oh my god I cannot believe it. it's been so long since I picked up this camera and vlogged I think I already said that I only have six minutes left on this memory card so let me go ahead and get into it so I just came back from Marshall's had a long day it's three o'clock right now my little cousin he is graduating from high school so he had like an award ceremony um, thing that he had and we all went to that and then we went to lunch and then I went to Marshall's. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into it. Y'all, honestly, this is just what I got today, but y'all know your girl. I've been going to Marshall's this whole time that I have not been vlogging. And I think what I'm gonna do is do like a styling video next week of like all the different things that I've been buying. So y'all can kind of see how your girl vibes out with the clothes or whatever. So anywho, I got this top actually returned it because I had got a small originally I liked it that much and when I tried it on like it fit but I'm like I would be more comfortable with the medium well I found the medium this top is so cute because look at the links obviously you can do so much with this black top but it's that extra detail that just has me like in a chokehold all right so one thing that I always buy from well i buy it from the contemporary section but like one of the very few things that i buy from the junior section are little shirts like this so i still check the quality of them like this is like a very thick um situation a very thick it's thick fabric what am i talking about um it's just a plain little gray tank obviously i can throw it on with anything it was only six bucks that black shirt was um 24.99 but it's house of harlow and if you know, you know, I love me some House of Harlow. Next up, I got these cute little ASIC shorts. Um, I like the, I just like the, the style of them. Not because they're ASICs at all, but they're just super cute. Hopefully I can fit them, but I needed some like little black shorts because it's almost that time of the month. And I normally wear black leggings. When my period is on point blank period and then in the summer i'll be hot as i don't know what i still wear black i only wear black when my period is on so if you see me wearing black it's because my period is on nine times out of ten so i needed something like that since it's hot outside i got this little tank just a little throw on shirt from the junior section y'all this is so heavy it's such good quality um it was only ten dollars so it's just like an acid washed color can wear it so many different ways i got a t-shirt from the men's section y'all if you go to marshall's please don't skip the men's section because i got two really good things today from the men's section um and my little thing is like i i say it's for landing so like if you want to wear it he can wear it but whatever <laughs> this shirt right here is the boys in the hood shirt and it has the detailing on the back. Like I don't buy graphic tee unless it has stuff on the back as well. I don't know, that's just my little thing. And then 
I don't know. I gotta try this on. Like, I'm gonna have to try this stuff on because I didn't at the store today. But this is so random. But these are like some little Dickies pants. And I just thought, like, this would be so cute to throw on with, like, let's say this little gray shirt. And look, it's just a cute little detailing for me. And I can wear, like, my cool grays. And that would just be such a cool little vibey outfit um i had this white sheer button down but i actually returned it i really want it though i returned it because i needed the next size up but they didn't have it that would be so cute to put with this like and wear it open with like a sheer button down but whatever all right and then i also grabbed these little shorts from the men's section this is really why because i thought it was so cute having the detail on the butt um but yeah super cute this was these were only 16.99 and when i tell you i'm gonna dress these up and it's gonna be so cute i can't wait so i'm super excited about the styling video that i'm gonna do or i'm gonna record next week grab nova some goggles because she always needs goggles for whatever reason um and then the rest of this, y'all don't care about. I just got some pool towels, but they're really cute. I got Nova this little stitch one. And then I got this pink and white stripe one. Super cute, super nice. And then I got Landon this one because it's more, you know, manly, I guess. So minus the pink, but still, I feel like this is a cute man's towel. So I just got us some towels. Um, that's it for today, but I'll catch y'all back up or I'll, I'll show y'all all the things that you haven't seen in the vlog in the styling video. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna get off of here and relax for a second before I have to go grab Nova. So I'll see y'all soon. What's up y'all? I changed the memory card. So we have storage now. I don't know how many minutes we have because it doesn't even say on this one. We're, oh, there we go. Eight hours, honey. Eight hours and 11 minutes. That's what I'm talking about. Anywho, I'm staying outside the post office. I'm about to go finally drop those boots off from um, to Zara. Y'all remember that nonsense that they sent me? So I'm dropping them off. And then I also have one package that I need to drop off for a customer. Um, so come on, let's go. Hopefully I can carry all this. All right, now that that's out the way and I didn't have to stand in line, praise the Lord. Why, first of all, why is it always a line at the post office and stuff? Like, it's almost borderline like the DMV. I don't really mess around with USPS. I'm a UPS girly. Y'all know Landon works for UPS. And I just like UPS way better than any of the other services. Um, I hate when I ever have to use FedEx because I don't even have a FedEx near me. And that's probably, I also don't have a USPS near me either. I only have a UPS near me. But, um, yeah. So now we gotta go get Nova. By the way, these glasses, I'm obsessed. Like, I feel like they are such a summer glasses thing and that's why I've been wearing them like nonstop. Um, I got them because I had lost my black Gucci glasses and those are like my everyday glasses. They're like the square ones. I feel like everybody has them or, you know, whatever, but I had them for like probably, I've had them longer than Nova was born, I think. So they gotta be like, seven years old <laughs> um but I lost them and then I was like when I was I was gonna just get the same ones because I love them so much and I probably will get them again honestly but when I was going to get the replacement I saw these and I was like you know what like my everyday glasses don't have to be black like they could be white too and these are huge but they're so cute like look they say Mew Mew on them. Um, I just love the shape of them. I love the fact that they're white and they're so effortlessly chic. But anyway, I'm about to start driving. Oh, and I did want to say, y'all, I cannot, I've tried, I've tried my hardest to lis listen to um, Sexy Red, but honey, I just, I'm too mature for that. Like, I just, I'm just not hood enough. I don't know. Granted, I'm not hood, period. You know what I'm saying? But, like, I literally can do nothing with Sexy Red and that music that she, whatever. Like, I do sing the Get It Sexy, 
good and sexy but that's it that's all i got for you because when i try and listen to her other stuff like when her album came out i went on there and i was like mm, let me see and i played the first song i was like yeah no i can't listen to this i cannot and i just i don't know like i was listening to like an apple playlist i think it's called like rap list or something like that i don't know rap life i think it's called but anyway they just update it all the time with like all the fire rap songs and there was a future song and i like future kind of like i like his music at least but he's a dog for one and like certain songs of his like i just can't listen to because they're just so disrespectful to women honestly so it's just like i can't but like some of his songs like i, I just can't let them go <laughs> but the songs where he's like talking crazy about women like i do not listen to them at all but anywho um on the song i never heard this song before but he basically says something about talking to the devil i'm like eh, next because no ma'am I ain't about to play nothing in this car talking about I'm talking to the devil. I ain't never trying to talk to no devil. So I feel like I say all that to say y'all know how everybody has been talking about that secular music stuff and Christians shouldn't be listening to it and all the things. I feel like you should use discernment. You know what I'm saying? Like I feel like um, for me, like I'm going to continue to listen to the music that I enjoy unless certain instances like that where it's like no 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 too far too far too far <laughs> um and yeah that's that's how i feel about it and i feel like people need to stop like putting what how they interpret things and how they do things on other people because like this is your own race this is their own race like stop worrying about other people worry about yourself worry about your kids worry about your tribe you know what i'm saying like stop getting on social media saying all this stuff like seriously y'all gotta chill out with that because it is just getting real noisy in the christian community and i don't know if it's like a i don't know it's almost like it's a bad thing because the craziness that like the extraness the all the things the people being disrespectful to god and his commands but saying they're christian like all that like it's just a lot of playing with god going on right now and i don't like it um but i also believe or it's not a but period i don't like it y'all i can listen to this song over and over first of all First of all, you need to understand this beat is crazy, Mustard. This might be the illest beat you ever produced in your life. And he got some fire beats, okay? But y'all. They not like us. They not like us. They not like us. This song is so fire. Number one, I ain't even wanted to be fire because I'm a J. Cole fan over and over and over again you know what i'm saying like j cole is my mans <sighs> but this song right here granted j cole ain't worried about none of this you know what i'm saying he he off the thing or whatever but kendrick he he did a big way i don't know like it could be the beat that's what i be trying to figure out sometimes it's like when the beats are so fire it could very well be the beat that makes the song the beat definitely plays a part in why that song is so fire for sure but he rolled on that he rolled on that song so good y'all but let me get off this thing bye i need you yeah i really do tell me what to do okay tell me what to do okay tell me what to do all i know is hit the mall and see what damage i could do okay and i think about you all day mommy I know I'm a pit bull, but darling, mommy, I just want to take you on a holiday, mommy, say what's on your mind, I'm a call away, mommy, come and rescue me, Whoa. take me out the club, take me out the trap, take me off the mark, take me off the map, I'm trying to hit the group chat and tell them. You guys, that is easily one of my favorite places 
I only got two bars this time and I ended up getting one for free and I didn't even know it. So apparently if you spend over a certain amount, then they'll give you, you get a free um, bar of soap, I guess. You get a free something um, every single month. I did not know that. But that's lit. It's good I didn't know it though because I probably would have gotten more stuff. So, yeah. Now we about to go to TJ Maxx real quick because one thing about me, when I'm in a little area, a new area, not even new area because, I mean, this is just like over here where my aunt lives. She lives in Wake Forest. But when I'm over in any area that I'm not normally in, I'm going to go in a TJ Maxx, honey. And right now, I'm on the hunt for, like, some jewelry. Like, I have my little staple jewelry. I have, like, my little... I have a two tennis necklaces. I have a gold one and a silver one. Like, these are, like, my, like, expensive pieces. That's all I really have. Um, and then I have, like... I don't know what it's called. I have, a, like, a little diamond necklace. And then I have a um, diamond necklace that has an L on it. And then I have my Roly And my, obviously, my... Um, engagement ring that's my jewelry but right now I'm in a like a stage where it's like I really um, go um, I really just want to tap into like the fun bold cute aesthetic jewelry and I don't want no cheap mess from Amazon you know what I'm saying like I want jewelry that will last so I feel like my best bet right now is just to go in places like TJ Maxx because they have like you know good quality stuff for affordable prices so we about to go in here and see what they have let's get it I cannot believe I finally found some Van Cleef dupes. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I'm not paying that much for costume jewelry because that's essentially what it is. <laughs> no, but I'm just, I don't know. I can't even let somebody else buy it for me. I just, I, it's something about it that I just can't get with spending that much money for it. So we duping it. And, um, yeah, so the one thing about the bracelet so is they have that little like end piece that obviously the real band cleaves don't have and i don't care you know because it ain't real so i don't care to like act like it's real or whatever but i also don't want that little the little dangling part that most of the dupes have like i don't like that because i don't want it to get hooked on stuff and stuff like that so I'm gonna try and see if I can like remove it and yeah but I did get I got the black one and I got the oyster color one I think they call it um I got those two and then I also got some other little jewelry things because I think I was telling y'all I just want to build like my little jewelry collection oh something hit my windshield but anyway um I did get some good pieces but I did spend a hundred dollars, so I'm kind of annoyed by that because, dang, I already spent like a hundred. I spent like two hundred dollars at Marshalls earlier today, and now I just spent a hundred dollars at TJ Maxx. When I go home, I hope half of the stuff that I got from Marshalls today doesn't fit, cause I ain't trying on nothing. 
and yeah because i don't need to be spending 300 dollars today i don't need to for what for no reason at all but if the bracelets work out that'll be great and i'm sitting at a light so i'll show y'all what i got so here's the oyster color one they were 16.99 and then the black one's close. So I can't show y'all right now. I got this little bangle. I was wanting a cute bangle. House of Harlow, like, y'all can just take all of my money, honestly. I got another little House of Harlow thing. It's just a, um, a ring, and it looks like a little bubble. I just thought it was cute. It's exactly the vibe that I was going for for my jewelry collection and it's like it's really good quality like you can tell it's not no cheap flimsy stuff and they had more things but i was like i need to get the heck up out of here like i have no business doing this right now <laughs> but low-key like now i know which tj maxx is lit because they got all the good stuff in there and i didn't even like i kind of want to go back but nova's probably gonna be ready to go home and I'm not really gonna be able to look like that with her there, so I'm gonna have to figure something out because I gotta go back. <laughs> or just like go to another TJ Maxx. But anyway, I'm about to pick her up from my aunts and then y'all probably won't see me again because I'm probably about to go home and take a nap, so I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all, one more thing. I forgot to show y'all these. These are so fire. How cute oh my god i'm so obsessed with these because i have like the smaller versions these are like the jumbo size ones and i didn't necessarily want to get the silver or the gold because i have the amazon dupe bottega earrings drop earrings but um i have the silver and the gold i didn't i wanted the bigger ones but i already like i'm very much a girl like i'm not gonna buy two more with two bigger sizes so i got a new style in the jumbo and it's just so cute like these are going to be so cute for the summer super excited about these so definitely a good time at tj maxx today thank you jesus wow. so i realized that it's men's which is crazy but i don't know if it fits landon he probably will like the black one i don't know if it fits landon then he can just have it but yeah y'all i'm so mad i freaking left my camera and we're actually doing something today Hey, Mom. Hi. Say hi, Nobby. Where are you? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I love my camera, but we're just going to rock out with the phone. Um, so, yeah, we're on our way to one of my cousin's houses for... Did you see this, Mom? I don't know. You kept it. Yeah. And I almost threw it away recently, so I was like, oh, it's just a little ribbon. I can use this. But yeah, we're on our way to celebrate. I'll polish my nails blue. Okay, and we all have on blue. Nobi has on her blue. And yeah, so we'll see y'all there. Sorry if this quality is crappy, but it's what we got to work with today.
recording this whole thing tell me all what we about to do but happy Sunday we're just getting out of the house at 621 it's been a long lazy day um but yeah me Landon and Nobby we're Snowy we're about to go meet some of my family to go bowling um at King's so come along with us as we do that because I had to bring the camera. I forgot my camera yesterday, so I didn't get to vlog all day yesterday. We had like um, this little cookout situation. Well, not a cookout, what was it? More like a dinner type of vibe or whatever um, yesterday. I think I might have gotten some footage on my phone just a little bit, so if I did, I, pop I have popped it in here already. But yeah, see y'all at Kings.
donut dipped in strawberry flavored icing with gold pink and white glitter sprinkles I don't know overrated yeah that sounds like it's not necessary but those other ones I can't wait they have your regular cake thing um yeah cake that's batter. a permanent one the cake batter I think that's like a permanent one of theirs Banana pudding is probably good. Yeah. Oh All my right, gosh. Eight glazed and four nine glazed. Hold on. Let's see what they have. Oh, they now have original glazed cinnamon rolls. Yeah, that's probably worth trying. Oh my god. What? Slow down. It's crazy. No, but you, got, you don't even have your seatbelt on. Seriously? We've been in the car for so long. Hey y'all, so I am all ready to go. I have so much stuff. Content creator girlies, how do you do it? I need a suitcase for this. So let's get going. I gotta delete some stuff off this memory card because it says it's no memory in it. So talk to y'all later, bye. I'm talking to my rich bestie. Say hi. Rich, I'm poor. The way you be ordering on that Amazon, honey, you got to have some money. Gosh, it's just a little work fit that I needed. Y'all, this lady. Did you see that I ordered it in another television? Yes, but then I also saw you canceled it. Because I ordered two by oh. mistake. Y'all, this lady got a hold of my Amazon and hasn't started ordering since. And at this point, I think you need to be the person that paid for Amazon because uh -huh. I don't even hardly use it. But I get multiple emails a day about your dealings. That is not true. Please don't. Don't believe her. Y'all, I will show you my email box. Like almost every day I get at least two emails. Either something's been delivered or yes, something's... Okay. You know I was trying to get my balcony together, so I did order the rug. And then while I was sitting out there, I was like, I need something for the mosquitoes. So I, you told me about the candles, so I ordered that. You ain't have to order from Amazon. <laughs> it was cheaper. Oh, okay. Cheaper Target. I got two candles for eleven ninety nine. I think Target. One was about that price. So, and that's all. I've just been trying to get my patio area together. Y'all, this lady. 
just just ordering up stuff and always sending me stuff trying to make me spend my money too i mean i always send you things that you need so i needed those shoes yesterday yes <laughs> no i promise y'all perfect like they'll they'll go with anything and they're only what they're 37 dollars i don't need they shoes that go them. with everything because i already got a hundred <laughs> that can go with something you don't have anything like those though yes right? i do my golden goose the ones that are like just white they go with everything. But these are not white. They are cream. I'm yeah. sure I have. I'm sure I have some cream shoes. I have some Jordan ones that are cream, actually. That I never show wear. The people the shoes. Huh? Do I need to show the people the shoes? No. Okay. Bye, vlog. They'll they'll probably be like, yeah, girl, you need those. Bye y'all. Bye mama. Please. I gotta get me something to eat. I don't have time for this. <laughs> no, but I'm trying to record something real quick. Went to Marsha's house no. to return something. Y'all already know how that goes. So first up, I got these super cute pens. I just, I needed pens. I did not look at the price. These were $6. I don't know if I would have paid $6 for them, but they better write super good. But they're so cute, and I know my daughter is probably about to try and steal them. But now I'm interested. Since they were $6, baby, you better write so good. Sorry, y'all. Y'all, internet nieces home on that Roblox. So anyway, got these two little tops. They were from Zara and they were only $8. So y'all know we don't have a Zara in Raleigh, North Carolina. So when I see Zara at Marshalls and TJ Maxx, a quick buy. So I got this little top. I mean, it's just a denim tube top. Um, it has like sparkles in it, which I don't know if y'all can see. I don't necessarily love it, but I know I have a million things that I can wear with this, so. I don't know, hopefully it fits. I just got a medium in, in both things, and then it has this in the back, so it should work. That's $8, and this one's the one I love the most, but I'm scared it's not gonna fit as cute as it looks. It's a top, but it looks like jeans. How stinking cute. Ah. Obsessed. No. Um, so. And then I went to Target and I got two things. So this first thing is just like this slut skirt. And it's super long and it's like a metallic gunmetal color. I am obsessed. I'm gonna throw this on with a t-shirt or a little tank top and my sambas or sambas, however you pronounce it, it's gonna be so cute. So that was what $25. And then I got this because I don't know, I just love like little simple tanks like this and I love the contrasting black with the white it's just so cute and this is only $8 how cute so that's I mean I could even wear that together if I wanted to but that's not why I got it but anyway that's all I have for you I think I'm about to cook dinner early tonight it's only 5 14 we eat dinner late around here but I'm starving and Nova's over there snacking on candy. So let me cook some dinner. I'm just cooking spaghetti. So. It's no point in showing y'all that. Cause... Bye, y'all. Oh, please. Why is this making all that noise? Okay. So, oddly enough, my friend, I guess. Um, it's like Sister Acts 30th, I don't know, something year. 
and my friend Alicia posted, this is crazy. <laughs> My friend Alicia posted this clip of Whoopi Goldberg, whatever her name is, and all the cast from Sister Act, and they were singing the song. So I'm like, oh yeah, we about to watch this because I've been trying to think of things that I feel like Nova needs to know or watch for the culture. Sister Act is definitely one of them ones. So, <gasps> la, 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 La 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 <laughs> Y'all, we about to watch it right now. I'm about to try and find it on this good old fire stick. So, we'll be back. What's up, vlog? I have been doing a horrible job at vlogging. And quite frankly, when I edit my vlogs, I don't really like the parts where I'm talking a lot. And I feel like if I pick up the camera, as you see what I'm about to start start doing is talking a lot and I don't know I feel like that's kind of boring but then sometimes I'll be talking about some profound stuff so it's like I don't know I don't know but <clears throat> just dropping up off to school got a package from Target they're just some swimsuits I need to get some new swimsuits um I haven't bought any in a while. Like I have like a Burberry one. I think I got that like last year, but I want to say that's like the last one that I purchased. And generally speaking, I buy bathing suits for vacations, which means that they're not technically like mom appropriate. And honestly, <laughs> this one right here isn't either, but it's the denim um, two piece set from Wild Fable. And I just had to have it. For one, I love denim. Love it. Um, but my Target never, I saw it in Target um, like a while ago, but they didn't have my size. So I'm like, oh, like I'll come across it, you know, when they have my size, whatever, whatever. And I never did. So I just went ahead and ordered it. So this is it. It's so cute. Um, I ordered a large because y'all, I ordered a large, I think in the top and the bottom. No, I ordered a medium in the top. I feel like I'm a medium up here, but down there I'm definitely a large because your girl, I don't know. But sometimes I get a large in the tops too because I don't, I like to be comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I don't want no super tight nothing on me, period. <laughs> Especially like something like a swimsuit that's restricting. So I got this one which is like, let me turn off some of these lights because y'all can't see nothing. It's just like getting washed out by all the lights. All right, so I got this one, which is like a metallic silver color one. Now I got this one in a large. The reason why I got it in a large, and this is a Tika tip of the day. If you see a bathing suit like this, it means that you cannot adjust it. Like you can technically adjust it there. So you can put this into like any of the three, but this, compared to this you have so much room to play with you know what i mean like you can put this at the very end of it if you want to you know but these like they just they i don't know any bathing suit that i have like this i'll get a medium and it's just i don't like the way that it feels around there so i just always get a large now that's something i learned just from hoarding clothes and everything else but anywho yeah i got this one I can't wait to try them on. Um, my cycle is semi on almost off, so I probably won't try them on. I don't know, it might be kind of off today, so we'll see. If it's off today, I'm going to the pool. I love going to the pool without my child. I ain't even gonna hold you. I go to the pool with Nova almost every day, and going to the pool by yourself as an adult is just way more peaceful. Like I don't have a beach here, but the pool in my backyard will suffice. So this looks so big and I need to not say this cause what if I put this on and yeah, this is not even, okay. I think I actually need a medium in this because this isn't like a junior size thing. This says it's a large size 12, 14. Y'all. 
I think I could do a medium. So I'm gonna try it on. And hopefully I actually need a medium. Cause I don't know, cause my butt is humongous. But yeah, I'm out to, just got back home. Wanted to show y'all those things. And I guess I can turn this light back on so y'all can see me. Um, oh, this dress right here. I got it for the boutique like months ago, but I never posted it. Let me see if I can kind of show y'all. It's just like a long pink dress. It has pockets. It's so cute. It's such a good throw on dress. I think I'm gonna make myself take some pictures in this. So I have it in, I think four different colors. It's pink, a blue, a black, and a green. And they're all like so good. But this is like the dress you need to throw on. I'm gonna definitely call this the throw on and go dress because that's exactly what it is. And I feel like ladies in their 30 somethings are gonna love this because we need stuff like this. We don't, we don't need to be having too much pressure. Not too much pressure on us girls because we be going through a lot, okay? Trying to reinvent ourselves. But anywho, that's all I gotta say. I'm about to read my Bible. I'm gonna go on the balcony and read it. I might make some coffee real quick before I do that. Then I need to clean up. But I feel like, I don't know, because I be seeing girls clean up on their vlogs, but I, it low-key don't interest me. So I don't know if that'll interest y'all. But yeah, I got to clean up. And then I'm going to go to the pool for my treat once I clean up. If I don't finish cleaning up, I'm not going to the pool. That's how I'm about to do it. I got to discipline myself. Cause I just be out here with the vibes. Anyway, bye y'all. Hi, Makina girl. <laughs> Anywho, y'all, this is the bathing suit. Ciao. Hold up. Let me pause you, girl, because I'm trying to hear what you're saying. But anyway, okay, y'all. Why on earth is this like? First of all, definitely, I was right about this top. These bottoms, they could be smaller, but they also could be perfect. I don't know, cause it's like, you see how it's like bunched up. So I might get the medium in them. I don't know. Let's try on the other one. Clearly doesn't cover nearly as much. The top fits perfectly. I think I got a medium in this and then the bottoms. I don't know how YouTube is, but I feel like I can go down a size. Definitely like both of these. Um, I love the silver because it's like mommy appropriate, you know, and it, it's high waisted. This is giving adult only resort. So Landon, where, where are we going for my birthday, honey? Cause I need to wear this. Personal pop is still a talking cause I got